20 years old. That's a lot, Mike. I mean, you just, you don't practice this. You don't, you don't, your know, practices aren't adjusted to playing this extended period. You're going to play 50 minutes of basketball. Strickland goes in the left hand. Nice. nice. Jump, jump to hit it. Nice. Now, how's that for a freshman to come off the bench and seemingly not even shake at all? Absolutely. And he's, he's got some freshness to him because obviously he's been in sporadically, but now he's in to play the, the full five. Wake by one. There have been 10 lead changes in this game. Oh! Oh! What a block by Strickland. Are you kidding? Trent Strickland on a flat rock, North Carolina. He said, no, sir. Get that out of here. Woo. Two big oh, plays in a row. I'm not tired. Talking about tired. Elbow over the rim. <laughs> Got the rebound off the miss by Melchione. Now, take your time getting into your offense, then you pick it up, become crisp. Rick Lillard, he has all the confidence in the world. Dribbles behind his back, goes down. Down the oh, 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 It's tipped in. It looked like Levy got a hand on it. There's that rebound that we talked about. Pass to the ball. Strickland made a great move. The best rebounding team in the nation. What's the thing? Oh, it's great to bring a freshman in off the bench who hasn't been getting that many minutes. He's playing like a starter. Turn it up a notch. Pull out Western. Here comes Duhon. Duhon down the lane against Levy. Knocked out of bounds out to the Blue Devil. Second overtime. Duhon short on the three. Retired by Danilus. Gets it out to Downey. Behind the back. Strickland. He missed it, but he's fine. He's out of gas. Yeah, they have. And you can't blame yeah. Duhon. He's been out there all night long yeah. handling the ball, playing defense. Yeah. He's just exhausted. That's right. And there's nobody else to go to. They had five guys foul out. It's up to Duhon and Dante Jones, and that's it. That's right. A great key to this second second overtime has been Trent Strickland. He has come in. He's missed some shots, but the energy that he brought in to this lineup, his teammates are just like dropping a pebble in the water. The, the waves, they just picked up on him. High school reputation as a shooter. 6'5", 190. I keep asking you about these small North Carolina towns. Where's oh, yeah. East Flat Rock? That's only about 10 miles east of my little hometown of Asheville, North Carolina. Actually, it's West. He's, he's my old homeboy, Bucket Mountain. Right? Is there a West Flat Rock? No, there's only East Flat Rock. Oh, they just stopped at East, huh? <laughs> 2 of 6, 1 oh, 6 to go in the game in double overtime. Levy. One lead. Reach in, steal by Dockery, is called for the foul. It's a very difficult game to evaluate. We had so many stoppages of play and now missing so many players. But one thing is for certain, Wake and hats off to Skip Prosser, who lost five of his top six players five of his top seven players last year and has brought in a great recruiting class and like he says we just try to win one at a time can't look ahead to anybody and Strickland got the bounce 88 76 weight with blocks pretty select come 90 to 78 Wake Forest will lead Maryland by a game in the ACC standings. They'll be up two in the last column against the Duke Blue Devils. A huge win here in Winston-Salem. They will split the season series. Duke beat them earlier at Cameron Indoor Stadium. Shot clock is off. Big plays, I think, in overtime, Mike, as we look at it. It's this great block by Trent Strickland, who came in and brought a lot of, lot of heat.
And then this big tip by Levy. I mean, career highs for him tonight. 15 points, 13 boards. Just outstanding. Certainly was. The Deacons have scored now over 90. 91-80 over Duke. Boy, you just wouldn't have thought that would be the score at this point in time. You thought it would be a last second shot. Well, no. And we actually played most of the night here. Six Wake Forest players in double figures. In another minute, this would be a three-hour game. Three hours. Melchione with a miss. Here's Strickland. Nine seconds to go. Strickland showtime. Deacons 94 over the Blue Devils 80. They have broken a 14 consecutive game losing streak. For Brad Darty and our entire ESPN crew, this is Mike Patrick. Thanks for listening, everybody. This has been a presentation.